Nicole Kidman and her husband Keith Urban have built an impressive property portfolio across the globe. The Australian couple has invested almost $60 million in real estate alone with their properties now estimated to be worth a total of $282 million. From the spacious 20-room mansion in Nashville where Nicole spends much of her time with the family to a lavish duplex in Manhattan and properties in their native Australia, the actress and her country singer husband have a luxury home for every season. Over the past decade, Nicole Kidman and Keith Urban have purchased six apartments in the luxurious Latitude building in Sydney's Milsons Point, combining two penthouses to create a mega apartment. Their purchases began in 2009 with a 4,500 square foot unit on the 21st floor for close to $6 million, followed by a 400 square foot apartment next door three years later, which offered even better harbor views for $7 million. In 2011, they bought a 19th floor apartment for $2.68 million, initially used as a home office and now converted into a gym. The couple later bought a two bedroom unit in 2021, which is leased out right now. Their most recent purchase was a three bedroom apartment costing $7.7 .7 million in 2023. Well, in total, Nicole and Keith have invested around $27.5 million in the building under various company names. And this is where the pair hosts their annual New Year's party. The Latitude Building offers homes with stunning views of the Harbor Bridge through floor to ceiling windows and wide balconies with interiors featuring a modern kitchen and neutral palette throughout for a contemporary feel. Nicole and Keith spend much of their time at their Nashville mansion, which they bought in 2008 for $3.47 million. This nearly 11,000 square foot home includes seven bedrooms and eight baths, providing plenty of space for the couple and their daughters, Faith and Sunday. Situated in the upscale, gated Northumberland community, just outside of Nashville, their grand estate ensures top level privacy and security. This mansion spans three luxurious floors and features a total of 20 rooms. Based on listing photos from the time of their purchase, the estate was styled in a classic decor with common areas that featured high ceilings, elegant drapes, archways, and marble flooring. Their living room measures a spacious 32 by 21 feet, while the formal dining room stretches 23 feet in length. The main level is full of French doors and large windows, bringing plenty of natural light into the space. Nearby, the kitchen showcases hardwood floors and high-end appliances and a loft-like lounge area sits atop the main staircase. Other rooms in the house include a rec room with a bar and pool table, a hobby room, and a home theater. Though not all bedrooms are visible in the available photos, Nicole and Keith's master suite features a fireplace and spa-like bathroom. The couple has renovated and updated their Nashville mansion to suit their preferences, as seen in more recent glimpses they've shared. For example, Nicole once shared a photo of herself studying Italian at home, sitting on a pale blue and cream armchair next to double doors that open to a balcony. Keith also has a recording studio in the home equipped with professional grade speakers, mixing decks and other equipment. In one photo, their cat Snow can be seen gazing out from the spacious hallway, which has wood floors and an antique rug. Outside, the estate is complete with beautiful landscaping, a large pool, a spa, and a full-size tennis court. There's also a play area for the children and a private creek on the property. Nicole and Keith also own a charming Australian farmhouse in New South Wales. Known as Bunya Hill, this retreat in Sutton Forest was purchased by the couple in 2008 for around $4.1 million. Hidden behind lush greenery, the property features a grand 1878 Georgian mansion with sandstone terraces, pressed metal ceilings, a carved cedar staircase, and 10 marble fireplaces. In the 1880s, the historic property was leased as a viceregal rural retreat for Lord Augustus Loftus a former governor of NSW. This elegant farmhouse sits on a vast 111 acre property. During a home tour for Vogue, Nicole highlighted the billiards room where she enjoys a game now and then, as well as the formal living room with a grand piano and a cozy fireplace. Their farm is also home to Black Angus cattle, an orchard and a guest cottage. 
And when they want to change from the countryside, they can go back to their penthouse apartments in Sydney. It's the best of both worlds. While these aren't all of Nicole Kidman's properties, you can see how each of the unique homes have character. Nicole and Keith also own a penthouse in Tribeca that they bought in 2020 for $3.5 million. So when the couple finds themselves in New York City, they have a 1,600 square foot space to call home. After taking a look at the multiple places Nicole Kidman and Keith Urban call home, that'll bring this video to a close. Thanks for watching. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and we'll see you all next time. Bye. As you know, before they were famous as partnered with Mogul Productions, allowing you access to Hollywood events and film sets, giving you the ability to crowdfund either as an investor or as a creator. We are talking producer credits or red carpet events. You can even get a walk on role in an upcoming feature film that will be released theatrically. No more Hollywood gatekeepers. Mogul Productions is making your Hollywood dreams accessible via Web3 and a strong connected community. We are also working with musical acts like Rella Ronzano. Haven't heard of him? Well, we just released his Before They Were Famous, which also included an in-depth interview. Mogul Productions has teamed up with Rello for his debut album release, Can't Escape the Allure. No matter what, you can't escape the allure. This isn't just an album launch, it's a revolutionary opportunity for early supporters to share in Rello's success, earning a portion of the album's profits. To make things even more interesting, Mogul is doing a token airdrop for those who wanna get involved with this project and invest in Mogul Productions. What you need to do is sign up for the whitelist now via Daily.io. Once this is done, comment done on this video and your Zaley username in the comments here and you will be entered to win mogul tokens. These will allow you to spend some coin on future campaigns like being a walk-on actor in a future movie. Heck, I'll even fly out with you. We have tons of collaborations and projects we'll be working on with mobile in the future, so stay tuned for weekly updates and I'll see you guys in another video.